the Bonnies. And Stockard, one away from his career high, has it. Griffin now. And the freshman, Lofton. McPeasy wants to get rid of it. He'll take it. Flat jumper from 17 is clean. He didn't want to shoot that, but he's <laughs> glad he did. Amadi Ikpizi does his work down low. He already hit two huge free throws late in regulation. Now he hits a jumper to put the home Bonnies back up by two. Now Crutcher, who hit a three and a two, both times putting his team back in front. Mike Sell, three out of the corner with just three to shoot. Ryan Mike Sell with the triple, putting the Flyers in front. Terrific performances individually and collectively from both teams. Just gutsy plays. And Mike Sell is nearing his season high. He's got 17. 18 is the most he scored this year. Walsh Top and deflects it. Walsh is fortunate on that. That pass wasn't there. He forced it. And credit Mike Sell. Look at Mike Sell getting his turn to lock down Stockard, St. Bonaventure's best player. Keep an eye on Stockard, who appeared to be cramping up some health issues late. How much does he have for an extra five minutes? Griffin going to work on top, and that's a difficult assignment. It's going to lead to a turnover. Davis, one on two, the other way will finish. Davis, great attack, really handling the ball on that. It started, though, with Toppin winning his one-on-one -on -one battle, putting, putting Griffin in a tough spot, nowhere to pass the ball. Dayton by three. Corner three, Stocker, no. That would have tied it. Now you want to work the entire shot clock. Or still just get the best one. Get the best one. Be aggressive. Too, too early not to can stay in attack mode. Well, they're going to turn it over as Davis fumbles it up top, and it's an over and back. Just an unforced error. We saw St. Bonaventure have a ball go through the hands earlier. 45 minutes of basketball. You're bound to have one or two of those. That's the first time I've seen Dayton make a play like that. Both teams have taken great care of the basketball so far. Just six turnovers in regulation for St. Bonaventure. Dayton only had nine. Lofton has to try to score against the mismatch. He'll take it right at Toppin. Kick. Three ball. The freshman Welch hits the triple to tie it. Freshman with a huge shot. Davis probably saw Toppin in trouble against the guard, gave a little too much help off of Welch. Getting extra minutes today because of the concussions to guards Poiser and Caputo, and Welch is in a pair of them. Two minutes to go, a tie game in overtime at St. Bonaventure. Game three of four on NBCSN today in the Atlantic 10. Stay tuned, more to go. Crutcher, a deep triple! Beats the shot clock, and the Flyers are back in front. I don't think there could be a more difficult shot than that three with the hand in the face at crunch time. Unbelievable shot. That was getting close to 28 to 30 feet. Crutcher time, as they say. He has done that before. What do the Bonnies have for an answer? Mike Sell staying attached to Stockard. Stockard can't get open. Lofton's going to have to go to work himself. Ikpizi hit a jumper a moment ago. That one rolls out. Welch there for the offensive rebound. And he'll shoot free throws. Coach Schmidt is finding out he not only has a freshman point guard and center for the next few years, but he's got a freshman wing in Welch. And there's Crutcher. The degree of difficulty on that is off the charts. Crutcher has 15 points, but it feels like a lot more than that. Because, as you said earlier, they've all been big. So he had the two to put them ahead late in regulation. For now, this is the one that put them ahead in overtime. Let's Dom, go back to the foul. Dom Welsh just coming from the weak side. 
Talk about getting a, ball, a rebound outside of your area. That ball didn't come to him. He was on the left wing and came all the way under the under the baseline to get a rebound on the right hand side. That's wanting the ball. Terrific effort play, rebounding out of your area when it matters a whole bunch. But Crutcher has fouled out, so the clutch player that's hit the three biggest shots of this game for Dayton is gone the rest of the way. Abani's already missing a shoey. Coming up, UMass and VCU will tip off on the NBC Sports app, and we'll join them at the end of this game. So go to the NBC Sports app. If you can get NBCSN, you can get the NBC Sports app for no charge. Big miss there. Here's where you follow your fundamentals. You have to get the big stop. Two-point game, just over a minute to go without Crutcher. Davis will initiate the offense for the Flyers. Looking to make it a two-possession game. And it's out of bounds. The pass too low for Landers. That was because Lofton, good one-on-one -on -one defense, and Welch right in the gap, taking up space. So Jordan didn't have, so Davis didn't have space to, to drive. Great off the ball defense by Welch. They did follow the fundamentals and get the stop. Down two. The Bonnies with the ball. And here's Stocker to season high 30. But Lofton has been the man trying to initiate recently. Nearly a turnover. Got it back. 15 to shoot. Still time to reset. Lofton picks up the dribble. Griffin with six to shoot. Drives. Trying to find contact. No. Offensive rebound. Back up and in. Tie game again. Sheer will. Sheer will power. Could we be seeing double overtime? Ten seconds left. Dayton won't use the timeout. They'll go at it. Davis off the screen. One on one. Stockard strips him. Floats at the horn. No. We go to double overtime at St. Bonaventure. How can you do better for a college basketball game? How can you do better? It's not March yet, but it's feeling like it here in the snow. We head to a second overtime. All money managers might seem the same, but some give their clients cookie cutter portfolios. Fisher Investments tailors portfolios to your goals and needs. Some only call when they have something to sell. Fisher calls regularly, so you stay informed. And while some advisors are happy to earn commissions, whether you do well or not, Fisher Investments fees are structured so we do better when you do better. Maybe that's why most of our clients come from other money managers. Fisher Investments, clearly better money management. The absolute best bed ever. Ever. You have a Casper too? We haven't slept this well in years. I will never leave my bed again. Life changing. With over 35,000 five-star reviews, it's the mattress people can't stop talking about. Now on sale. Visit Casper.com for details. This is your car. You had a good run, but it's time to sell or trade it in, and you need to know what it's worth. With TrueCar, just enter your license plate and see your car's value in real time. Sports package and low mileage? Nice. Incident with a shopping cart? Not so nice. Sunroof? Real nice. Within minutes, you'll have a true cash offer, and you can head to a local certified dealership to cash out or trade in. Enjoy a better way to sell or trade in your car with True Car. We're now looking at a 50-minute college basketball game at minimum. Welcome to overtime number two from St. Bonaventure, New York. The host Bonnies have won four.